Hey YouTubers, it's the Count, Mr. Decula and Mr. Hello. Patrick for our first in the gym training video at Spartan Subs HQ. In this workout, we are hitting a squat workout, doing some squats, working up to some, some heavy stuff, some speed stuff, some accessory stuff, uh, training for strength. Here we got featuring Little Matty. Um, little Matty's hitting a... Uh, AMRAP set here for as many reps as possible as he can with what are we on there 345 pound 156 kilos on the bar hitting a set of 12 for this one um, course warming up we like to use the uh, slingshot hip circles to warm up doing some um, crab walk doing some hip flexor warm ups and Getting those hips nice and warm, also doing some light leg extensions, some rotator cuff work, getting the shoulders and the and the body all ready to go. And grind this set out here. Nice and deep. Matty's Wait wearing for him himself. To finish up, then we'll get into the real action. Into a real set. Here's oh, no, this is this is still my last warm up set. So there's one sixty five or three hundred and sixty five pounds if you will. Three sixty five for my last uh, warm up. Imperial could have gone a little bit deeper. Yeah. Plenty of, plenty of warm-up sets, but we call them like preparation sets, getting ready for your maximal weight. Um, what have I got going on here? A I lot of like paleness. A lot of... There must be the lighting, because there must be a serious spotlight. Yeah, 315 or 143 kilos, I think that is. Um, hitting a... Uh, my workout this week entails that I do uh, two sets of eight with this weight so this one felt pretty comfortable the depth looks a little looks a little bit on the high side to me so it could have been a, a, a little I little deeper camera angle bro must be the downward angle when in doubt blame the cameraman <laughs> Ooh, here uh, we go some 405 for a couple of doubles here we go 184 what, kilos little, on the bar for the, for the count and then okay maybe for a, a little a shallow ferocious set of two so I'm doing 531 at the minute and this is my uh Peakish week, and now we are little Matty little here Maddie. going with some uh, some accessory work, some extra volume work. Same weight, he's got five sets of three with the same weight. I think we only recorded four of the sets. Um, here is myself here is trick. going again with the three plates. So we got a second set of eight here, which is my, uh, my last big working set for this particular workout. Sort of this work, the programming that I'm doing at the moment Ooh, requires me to hit again. lots of volume. So Cam, what you got? You got uh, three sets of two at this weight, yeah? Yep. So this is my uh, peak week of 5-3-1. So I was doing one plus. So I did three doubles at 4.05. And here's little Maddie going again with uh, three, we got 155 kilos for five sets of three. Just some extra volume work and some extra, just extra work gets you better at the lift. Um, it's myself going again. We've got uh, 100, about 115 kilos on the bar. 115, yeah, about 115. And doing some sort of momentary pause, beltless, no no wraps, no straps, no equipment as such. Getting Here's some extra work in. my last set. Struggling a little. First rep pretty good. About to bust out my schwinky. Little Second grindy. rep, a little grindy, but that's the end of a work, yeah? If you're not, if your reps look perfect, you're probably not training that hard. Here's little Matty going again with another set of three, getting in lots of volume on this particular workout. And here's my tan self, um, getting in some high, some extra low bar work, actually. I've been hitting more low bar work, so I find it helps with uh, just getting more efficient at the lift. More volume means more work. That's we Spartan's got uh, custom plate. Spartan's plates going on the bar there. On uh, using Ooh, a spinning twenties. Using a so ex extra stiff iron edge deadlift bar. With, with this thing has got no flex at under six plates. Here's me hitting up a set of twelve. Bit of a AMRAP set, many reps as you can with a given weight. 
I was getting under the bar and I was just going to see if it was if it felt heavy. I was just going to do five and it felt all right, so I just decided to do twelve for some reason. Busting out some repetitions. <laughs> It's a good method to use. Little Matty the... hitting the shadow squats in the background there. <laughs> yeah, extra, getting the extra right, body yeah, weight, vol- <laughs> extra, extra body weight volume in there. Hitting some, shallow, but... hitting some pretty solid reps there. But one of the things, if your if your goal, and we're training here for strength, if your goal is to increase strength, you need to be hitting extra work and training like with a lot of volume to increase your overall output. Uh, here we go, doing some. One inch deficit deadlifts as an accessory lift. Um, we got little Maddie working up. We've got about 140 kilos on the bar. We've got some big ass bumper plates on there to make it look like a lot of weight. Uh, little Maddie is pulling no straps or wraps or anything like that or belts. Um, he's hitting uh, it's three sets of eight with 140 on this deficit. And you'll find that a deficit on a sumo lift is, is pretty exaggerated and really talks your hips. So it's a great way of underloading and improving your max lift without frying your nervous system. Pretty solid lifts there, Matty. Uh, here's myself again. I'm hitting uh, a few sets of five for some, a bit of a blend of uh, speed off the floor, power through the rep, and uh, yeah, just getting in some extra work. Guest appearance by Nath the Peanut, busting in on my action. Here's Dekula hitting some, he squats four for three sets of two. <laughs> But can single leg leg press a, a couple of grams <laughs> halfway uh, with some pretty pathetic repetitions. Once you've done the, once you've done your your big squat, we're all, we're all pretty fried at this time point. It's just getting in extra work. Extra I did do some front work. squats. I was a bit of a girl's blouse and didn't do any, <laughs> didn't do any deadlifts. I was deadlift on Friday. Ooh, clearly some ferocious work. We got a little Maddie going again with uh, same weight, 140 for sets of eight. He's really uh, he switched from conventional into the uh, sumo dead, so trying to work in extra volume on his sumo deadlift to bring it up, get more efficient. One of the best things you can do for strength training is to just get better at the lift. Not so much always just training heavy and trying to bust something in a snap city, but actually getting better at the lift. And underloading like this is a great way to go about it. Locking out like a pro. And I think this is my last set. So, no, we, on our accessory lifts, generally we won't wear any, you know, straps or wraps or belts or anything like that. Great way of underloading, working on keeping your core and abs and so on, body tight. Here's Nath finishing up with his top end AM wrap set with four biscuits aside. Four plates, 184 kilos. Um, wearing just a belt and some, some knee sleeves which do not add a single gram. Nath went in at an impress- impressive 74 kilos. <laughs> <laughs> the coat hanger squat. Hitting, uh, <laughs> hitting a set of nine. Oh, damn impressive squat. And a really, uh, definitely a PB for Nathan. Hey viewers, thanks for watching. Make sure if you like this video, you hit the subscribe button down below so you can stay up to date with everything Spartan Subs related. We're going to be coming at you with product reviews, product demonstrations, uh, supplement reviews, as well as supplement jewels. So we're going to be comparing the best products on the market and what's going to work best for you. Uh, make sure as well, if you need any supplements or apparel, head over to SpartanSubs.com and we'll hook you up. Make sure you watch the videos in the sidebar here. And from Spartan Subs, I'm Declan and I'm out.